After the opening races at Brands Hatch, the 2013 Dunlop MSA British Touring Car Championship action switched to Donington Park for round two. It was defending champion Gordon Shedden who took pole position in his Honda, with Frank Raffles' Toyota lining up alongside the Scotsman on the front row. As the lights went out, Shedden made a great getaway and got his title defence back on track with a pillar-to-post victory, doing just enough to see off a late challenge from a fast-closing Andrew Jordan. Behind the two leaders, McNeil made it three Honda drivers on the podium, fending off the MG of arch-rival Jason Plato to claim third. Adam Morgan continued his good early season form, coming through to finish fifth from Sam Tordoff in the second of the MGs and a fading raffle. Donington's second showdown marked two special milestones. It was Jason Plato's 400th British touring car start and incredibly also Matt Neal's 500th. Having won the opening race, Shedden started on pole, but Jordan wasted no time squeezing his way through into the lead. Behind them, Plato battled his way past Neal and then closed down Shedden. The champion defended bravely, but there was no stopping the MG as Plato forced his way through into second after a terrific battle. It was Jordan, though, who took the chequered flag to make it four different winners in the first five races. With the top ten reversed and drizzle in the air, the final race of the day promised to be a cracker, and it didn't disappoint. Tom Onslow Cole started from pole, but fellow front row man Colin Turkington grabbed the lead. The hectic early lap saw Dave Newsham spin spectacularly, but luckily his gyrating Toyota was missed as the crowded midfield dodged its way past. With everyone battling behind, Turkington made his escape to give the new BMW its maiden victory, while the two Hondas of Shedden and Neil fought their way through to finish second and third. After the dust settled, Louise Goodman caught up with a delighted Colin Turkington. Well, Colin, the sign there says it all. P1, Colin, fantastic to get your first win in the brand new BMW. Yeah, it was uh, it was a good day, good day's work for for me and the uh, eBay Motors team, and uh, a big reward for for all the hard work that's uh, that's went in really for for the past six months. And um, you know, we're really starting to to make a bit of progress with with the car now. Um, obviously, starting P2 makes it makes it a bit easier, but um, you know, we we leave today very confident, and uh, hopefully, it's a a good springboard for the rest of the season. Well, I guess the big question is, are you going to be able to maintain this pace going through to Thruxton? I, I, I hope so. Um, you know, obviously we, we are improving all the time, but we're still we're still not there yet. And, um, you know, I think Thruxton is going to be uh, another challenge for us. You know, we go on to the, the hard compound tyre, which which I guess none of us really have, have run before. But, uh, you know, we just have to, to, to keep working hard, I think, is is the key. Making small steps and try and, trying to improve the car. But, you know, a bit of confidence and, and a win really, really helps your, your motivation. What are you looking for from a car, not just you but everybody in the field when you get to a circuit a far circuit like Thruxton I think you just want a car that's that's easy to drive and and that gives you confidence and uh, with particularly with with the rear wheel drive the feeling of some grip at at the rear you know when when the rear sliding about you get a little bit nervous in in, in the seat so uh, yeah we'll uh, we'll do, do our homework and hopefully we'll come out of the blocks fast we look forward to seeing you there thank you